way, falling like all day, gotta get that play, doing it all way, that dead play, you see I squeeze like always, falling like all day, gotta get that pay, doing it all way. Pick em and pack em, flip em and stack em, pick em and stack em, wreck em and back em. What's up YouTube, this your boy MZ from MZ Toss Boxing. Well Bernie, you all know Carl Champs, I try to um, apologize. For what he said on Bud's Terry Bud Crawford um platform. But when he called Champ Side, you know, he got on and uh he was pretty confrontational. He wanted Champ Side to listen to him, but he didn't want to understand to listen to Champ Side when Champ Side was trying to explain to him what the problem was. So I'ma just say it like this real quick because I got slack from the first time uh I did the video, I believe the phrase they sent me was a hit dog will holler. And we hollering pretty loud over here. Well, one, I'm the type of person if you say something, you stand by. If you wrong, you apologize, talk it out, and let it die. But when your mental is not that strong, yes, I see when your mental is not that strong, you stay in a big case to make yourself look like an ass. Now, hmm, you're trying to explain that Bud didn't say none of that and Bud didn't really have no part of that. Well, I call bullshit on that because Bud was in the background co-signing, telling you, don't forget about Pacquiao and speak on this and speak on that. He was co-signing that weak shit that his boy was talking. Then you called Champside to apologize, but your apology was bullshit because you was confrontational with it. Now I said in the first video... Bud's homeboy actions made him look like a hoe. Where I come from, you speak for yourself. Now, he want to say, oh, Bud, let me use his phone. He let me use his platform. How dumb is that? Stupid as fuck, if you ask me. And yeah, I said it just like that. I'm saying some pretty bomb words today because I feel like some of you people don't get it. What kind of man would let another man jump on his platform and diss a bunch of platforms that's riding for you? Now, you can't walk that back. You can't. Now, the class act thing to do would have been for Bud to come and say, look, my apologies that my boy went off like he did. You know what I'm saying? He said some things that, that, that are not my view. His views are his views. My views are my views. That would have been a smart thing to do. But y'all compounded the problem by letting him get on to apologize. And y'all heard his apology. That dude there was sounding ignorant. Uncouth. Now. If we get to the Bud and Spence fight, great. If Bud called uh, Spence and they talked about it and they said they're going to fight in 2020 late, great. But it's my opinion, humble as it is, that you should keep your boy away from your phone, your platform, and from any in front of any camera or microphone. Because I see a lot of people don't understand this is the age of the internet. Information is given pretty much freely. Watch your mouth when you're standing in front of a camera. Because you mess around and let something come out that you can't walk back. Straight up. 